Hi guys and welcome to a new video for Infinity Kingdom. This is Biakia from Silver49 and I'm going to talk today about, about an important thing. It's a skill. And it is not an ordinary skill because it's a skill in the Tower of Knowledge and it is an aura. What is an aura specifically? There is a skill as you see here, it's passive and there is also uh, a passive skills. There are some uh, triggered skills and auras skills and grace skills for example this is a grace skill and uh, this is um, a, tr a triggered skill as you see here and there are some skills as I'm going to talk about weakness it is an aura the aura as you see here Im each immortal can only equip one aura skill this is uh, an important skill and you can only equip one aura per immortal so if you are going to use four auras you can going you are going to use uh, one aura per immortal but if you are going to use any other skill like uh, triggered skills uh, passive skills or grace skills you can equip um, maximum three per immortals because every immortal can only equip three skills but uh, he has a limit of only equipping one aura uh, I have to uh, describe this clearly for you. As you see here, my Charles have an aura here. If I try to put another aura, you only can equip uh, one aura per immortal. So, I'm going to talk about weakness. Uh, what is weakness? As you see here, uh, weakness from its uh, title. It is something that weaken uh, the uh, enemy uh, marsh or enemy immortals. Uh, let's uh, read the skill information. Once the battle starts, reduces the resilience rate of all enemy units by 20%. It starts from 6% per level 1 and for level 8 it's 20%. Resilience rate, it is um, an, import, an important uh, value. Let me show you here my uh, Charles. He is a defensive uh, immortal and I'm putting resilience value on him because resilience value will prevent him getting uh, critical hits so if you uh, check his information you will see the uh, resilience value here um, sorry I'm not seeing it clearly okay uh, resilience here as you see resilience is uh, almost uh, 3000 and if I am facing um, a fire marsh for example or water marsh or any other marsh that uses weakness uh, the weakness will be uh, decreasing my resilience value by 20% so if it is uh, 3000 so 20% of the 3000 equal to 600 so I'm going to be around uh, 2000 and um, 300 or almost 300 uh, resilience value and I'm going to uh, get uh, lots of critical hits let me show you some of the arena rewards um, I hope I can check uh, um, a fire marsh here. Let me uh, describe on my fire marsh because my fire marsh uses weakness. Here, as you see, I'm putting weakness on um, Hippolyta. So all the four immortals of my uh, of their uh, enemy uh, immortals <clears throat> are going to have 20% of the resilience value or resilience uh, uh, decreased by 20%. And uh, the meaning of that, that I am going to hit more critical hits because I am going to have a, ch a higher chance to have uh, critical hits. Let me show you my marsh uh, numbers and how many uh, critical I hit. As you see here, fighting well hit uh, almost uh, 75 uh, of the critical hit and one is dodged. If I was going to hit this one, I'm sure it was going to be uh, critical. So because I am using weakness, I am hitting uh, lots of, uh, this is lifelink of course, so uh, it was uh, physical damage and the redirect doesn't uh, crit. So as you see here, Hippolyta deals uh, lots of critical hits. Let me show you the artifacts of Folium. It doesn't have, it has uh, some uh, critical value, it doesn't uh, have that much. And the critical uh, hit is 2700. And for Embrace Wu, for example, I have a critical rate uh, artifact and here uh, critical hit are higher than um, William. But for um, Embrace Wu, it has, as you see, almost 73% critical. Chase, uh, everything she deals is almost critical. 
and let's change the marsh and see the stats of other marsh as you see here i'm having caution uh, aura and i'm having misleading aura and i don't have any other auras so the chances of critical as you see here the normal attacks for my charles are all normal attacks no critical hits also for alexander normal attacks all uh, the damage is coming from uh, normal attacks no critical hits zero critical hits because i'm not using weakness if i am using weakness at least there will be uh, a little portion a portion of uh, dealing critical and the higher uh, chance of dealing critical of course uh, i can deal one or two um, normal attacks from critical because there is a tick critical uh, value as you see here the my critical value our bonuses i have some of the vib stats some of the lord talent because i'm using lord talent critical and academy but i'm talking mainly about weakness so weakness here is the main reason that my uh, fire marsh is dealing uh, damage and of course you can use weakness on fire marsh because the fire marsh is mainly dealing uh, critical hits and also water marsh of course you can use um, critical hits on wind marsh because if you are using baldwin and uh, baldwin skill is so broken if you are using him in the wind marsh also if you can uh, if you are using a shadow marsh but i'm not going to talk about that uh, elo uh, of uh, whales because most of whales uh, paying lots of money to open uh, premium skills i'm talking about uh, the skills we are all using let me show you some of uh, the marshes are using weakness on i'm opening the strongest true bar so this is a uh, here a shadow marsh um, he is using misleading aura he is in, he is using weakness as well let me show you uh, demon hunter is a uh, water marsh i'm sure he is using weakness at least yes he is using weakness any fire marsh will find him using weakness let me uh, check my uh, green because i know the fire marsh is in my green so let me check here kinkade is water marsh of course he is using weakness i'm 100 percent sure he is also a breast officer and hopes is a fire marsh i'm sure she is using weakness for example uh, this marsh here is a hybrid uh, alexander uh, earth marsh uh, with zenobia and hannibal um can ember wind marsh uh, in the earth uh, dragon um they won't need uh, weakness that much because they are not focusing uh, on crit um, yes, I was right. So this marsh is using uh, attacks, normal attacks. So he is not going to use a crit. He is going to use attack speed, gaining the attack speed from berserk. Uh, for example, I'm going to talk about berserk uh, in uh, individual video. I'm not going to make this video that long. Uh, so weakness is the main source of critical. So any marsh you deal uh, or any marsh uh, you are trying to crit with. Of course, uh, fire and water also crit because Merlin can crit a lot. Uh, another tips to make uh, the water marsh crit more. And uh, the main reason that uh, the fire marsh crit also the fire drake gives buffs for uh, critical damage. But the water marsh only buffs uh, healing and also freezing enemies. So why would you use a critical on a marsh that doesn't increase critical damage? Mainly because Merlin uh, skill is so broken, you can use critical on him, uh, critical uh, value uh, artifact of course, and weakness in his marsh. And you can use a skill that enhances the crit rate. Uh, I'm going to talk uh, about it uh, in more video. It was here. For example, you can increase the crit rate, but weakness would be the main source of critical because it's going to decrease the resilience value of enemies. There is a counter for weakness. It is malice. Let me check here. If you are facing a fire marsh, for example, or a water marsh, I highly recommend using uh, malice because the malice, malice is the opposite of weakness. So they both counter each other. So um, I'm going to use malice in the same marsh that I'm using weakness in my fire marsh. For example, if I am facing water, I'm going to uh, counter the weakness in the water marsh and keeping the resilience rate uh, decreased. The malice here critical uh, reduces the crit rate of all enemy unit by 20% for max level. So of course I'm using it in my uh, fire marsh, but sometimes when I'm facing a water marsh or fire marsh with my earth marsh, it's better to uh, use malice in here in this marsh, just to uh, 
to decrease the crit rate of the fire march i'm facing he is going to use weakness and uh, this is all for this video i hope you enjoyed and learned something new don't forget to like and subscribe to my video see you soon